as enough. As Sussex is heading to catastrophe with the US business, the be suspended after £88 million Netflix release. Prince Harry will find himself out in the cold after Netflix releases his £88 million documentary series next month. A commentator has said, as the pair's love story is said to show Prince Harry and Meghan Markle discussing other royals, including King Charles and Prince William, following a tough year for the firm. However, the young children might well make an appearance. However small in their parents' new upcoming Netflix docuseries, which is set to launch in early December. It is thought that the initial title of their project was Chapters. However, the final title has yet to be revealed. While Archie and Lilibet may not be on camera, footage of them, or indeed the new photos, could be shown in the program. As royal commentator Prue McShroon had said that the public has turned on the couple after the death of the Queen and that the series will see Harry out in the cold. There was so much love for the woman and sympathy for her, and now I think that he has seen what he has done, and I think that he is probably laminating it. And it's a runaway train from him, because Netflix wants to capitalize on what has happened this year, and I think that he's really going to find himself out in the cold, as he has made his bed, and he is going to have to lie in it. As to go alongside the decrease in his Duchess's popularity in the US, the recent poll had pointed out that many Americans were baffled as to how the Duchess of Sussex has kept her royal title, despite even no longer being a senior working royal. As Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have done so much to really try and destroy the royal family. Speaking of Meghan, she had added, Here in the US, when they came here, Meghan was quite popular. You could see that in the polls, and now, the public opinion polls show that the Americans are turning their backs on her. As Megan is just so obnoxious and doesn't know when just to be quiet. As some things are better kept quiet, as it is not classy how she is airing all of this dirty laundry and complaining about the royal family. It is really not a good look, and people are starting to turn on her. As so many people in England are happy, and the UK are happy to see them gone. As Prince Harry has a lot on his plate this holiday season, especially his highly anticipated memoir, Spare, on January 10th, 2023, as there's going to be a lot of heat on the Duke of Sussex. And then as some of his close friends had worried, as the people close to Prince Harry have questioned why he is digging up again some of his memories from the past to include them in his upcoming work. As editor-in-chief Nick Bullen had claimed that the Duke of Sussex has been talking to his friends from his childhood in order to drudge up some of the most impactful memories from years ago, including some of the darker and more painful ones. As this move, however, left some baffled and asking why the royal would go back over his old brand, Mr. Bullen had said. While conceding he didn't know whether Harry was planning to include these memories in his upcoming memoir, or in a rumored Netflix docuseries, the expert had told. As now, whether that is for the book or the documentary, I don't know. But I know a lot of people have been saying to him, Why are you going back over this old brand? Why are you digging all of this up again? And so I think, those closest to him in the UK, or those who are very close to him in the UK, is the past, and are slightly concerned about how far he's going. And now, whether he puts all of that in the book or the doc, I don't know. But he certainly has been doing a lot of early childhood research.